The nunchaku, another farm implement, is made of two pieces of wood held together by a strong rope or chain. The nunchaku is very popular among students throughout the world, but as a word of caution, it may be illegal in many areas. Practice carefully and safely. For this series on Okinawan Kobudo, Black Belt Magazine is proud to present Sensei Fumio Demura. Ryukyu Kobudo Training of Okinawa weapons. Before you go today about Kobudo, Japanese Kobudo and Okinawa Kobudo, two different meaning behind. Japanese Kobudo, such as Judo, Karate Do, Aikido, Kendo, and Iaido, and all other spear, sword, dagger, main purpose to using for combat. Okinawa Kobudo meaning is survival, such as Tongfa, Bow, Ekubo, Kama. All these weapons is farmer's tool. Today, I'd like to show you about basic of nunchaku, we call so setsukon. We have three category of weapons. One, long weapons, which is bow, ekubo, and other long stick, and short weapon, which is sai, kama, tongfa. And third one is hitting weapons. Nunchaku is one of number three because when you see this, it's a very short. And when you're swinging, you make extend to the longer. Therefore, it's very easy to use, but same time, if you don't watch enough, very dangerous. Nunchaku is basically idea come from that in holds the mouse. And also, Rice harvest. Now, type of nunchaku. Basically, we have standard is very about 12 inches long to stick. And the most nunchaku is rope or some a chain. Uh, this is the basically we use in here. Uh, this is a little longer than other one. It's using for more combat. This is a little different type of it. This is the one side is longer and the other side is short. So sometimes we use this way to swing and sometimes offset, you hold it this way and use the wrong size. And also, nunchaku have called sansetsukon, which is the three, and also uh, yonsetsukon, four. 
This is the not original one, but it's made steel, but usually original one is wood. This is called sunset cone. Tachikata. Tachikata is a very important because foundations. If you don't have any good strong stance, upper body are not functions. Therefore, I want to do corrections. First, Heisoku Dachi. Musubi Dachi. Heiko Dachi. Neko Washi Dachi. Shiko Dachi. Kokutsu Dachi. Then Kutsudachi. Kosa Dachi. Shirasagi Ashi Dachi. Eisoku Dachi. Musubi Dachi. Heiko Dachi. Neko Washi Dachi. Shiko Dachi. Kokutsu Dachi. Zenkutsu Dachi. Kosa Dachi. Shirasagi Ashi Dachi. Next, Gripin. Nigiri Kata. Gripping is basically six standard over the grabbing, one bottom of the nunchakus, and two middle, and three it's top, and the four is the reverse, five, six. Now, what the difference between this side? When you hold it this way and swinging, it's a little bit slow, but much more power. When you go to cross the top, no power, but make faster. That's the reason we always control what we use for. And also, grabbing is combined, combinations. One hand this way, one hand other. 
o and both same time to strike to block also nunchaku is hitting weapons for example why you hold one hand but from here you strike in this way and one hand make more longer therefore very dangerous Kata, swinging. The swinging is basically side or sometimes low. And also beside And figure eight. And also, you can grab reverse grabbing. And side. Now, when you're swinging, the very important is this part here. When you change the directions, when you come up this way here, and if you're too deep, you hit the back. Because nunchaku is right here. How to control? You have to be back, so you don't go down, touch the back. So this control is very important. For example, one
to Kamikata. How to catch nunchaku. First, upper, Side. Next, we turn back from the side. On the arm, Ampet.
also on the legs. My positions. First, upper. Side. Reverse. Front, behind, side of hips. Under the shoulder, armpit, Leverage and pressure. I have two nunchakus here. One long rope, one short rope. When you twist long nunchak, long rope nunchaku doesn't work. But the short one work. And also, short one, it's much more fast swinging. Long one, a little bit slow, but long one, reach more longer. Skikata. Striking technique. When you tsukikata, striking technique is this. Gripping is very important. If you weak grabbing, you might not walk. First.
Next. Kata. Unfortunately, it's only one weapon, nunchaku, is no traditional katas. Therefore, I made for training katas, but still very difficult every movement. But I want you to practice and keep comfortable. If you don't not comfortable, you must training more to make it more comfortable. And especially if you cannot catch, you repeat again till you catch, then continue to the next movement. This is the nunchaku kihon no kata.
like this kion gata some technique some part of a technique I like to give you a little bit of applications why we do that first first movement this movement is in case somebody grab you using take out by hand Also, in case someone's stronger, so if he's trying to strike, doesn't work. And then use the bottom of the nunchaku. Next. In this case. Next. Remember, nunchaku, some state still illegal, and doesn't matter where it is, make sure, watch yourself. And also, watch rope, make sure strong enough to hold the nunchaku, and also, watch your hand, if you're wet, it's really slippery, so you must dry up. Remember. Nunchaku is not a toy. I want you seriously training and study. Sensei Fumio Demura is a world-renowned master of Japanese karate and Okinawan kobudo. His books and videos are sold throughout the world. Sensei Damara teaches the traditional and proper techniques of Kobudo arts. And now, a review of the Okinawan Kobudo weapons.
The nunchaku, another farm implement, is made of two pieces of wood held together by a strong rope or chain. The nunchaku is very popular among students throughout the world, but as a word of caution, it may be illegal in many areas. Practice carefully and safely. The bow is possibly the most practiced of the Okinawan kobudo weapons. The bow is about six foot long, but there are many variations in size. Also, it is very practical since any discarded stick or tree branch can be utilized in self-defense. Sai is a three-pronged metal instrument used by Okinawan farmers in planting rice crops. It is considered one of the more advanced weapons to develop your eye and hand coordination. Since it is made of metal, please use caution when practicing.
comma, as we can obviously see, is what the world knows as a sickle, another tool that the Okinawan farmers so skillfully adapted for their self-defense. Since it is sharp and can be dangerous, we recommend that you tape the blade edge and the points for safety. The Tomfa. This farm tool has also been developed into a weapon of defense by the Okinawans. It is interesting to note that the Tomfa has been modified for use by law enforcement in place of the baton. Weapons of Kobudo, another fascinating aspect of martial arts presented by Sensei Fumio Demura.
violence is right behind you. You can fight back with self-defense, and the best source is Black Belt Magazine, the world's leading magazine of self-defense. Learn how to defend yourself with fully illustrated in-depth articles, interviews with martial arts celebrities, plus trends and current events. Go with the best, Black Belt. To subscribe today, call 1-800-57-KARATE. Order now and you'll receive your choice of a free Black Belt t-shirt or watch. That's 1-800-57-KARATE.